Hey, hey, hey. So today we're going to be working on our beautiful reverse undulation. So there's a lot of things I see with this one that I really want to make sure we are keeping in mind as we drill. So one of the things with our reverse undulation is there's a lot of people who go like this, right? And you can take a guess as to why that's not the best thing for your body. So what we want to drill is going up, up, up versus forward with the body. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 One, two, up, up, and up versus forward, 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 like this, right? You want it up, 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 up. Tuck, roll up, 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 tuck, roll up. So we're going to have five, six to the right, and here we go. It's one, two, three, four, four more, five, six, seven, eight, other side, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Eight and to the front. One, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, and eight. So as you're drilling this, you want to keep it controlled right underneath your body frame. Try not to sway so much forward and so much back. And then see if you can involve your chest in a way that makes it come up subtly as well as keeping it right here, right? So Try it out between the two and let me know how it goes.